There are questions tonight about the use of NYPD detectives assigned to Mayor de Blasio's protective unit, uh, about those detectives being assigned to take his son Dante back and forth to college. CBS 2's political reporter Marsha Kramer has the story. You usually see these NYPD detectives guarding the mayor and his wife, Shirlane McRae. After all, their job is to protect them. But is their job to act as highly compensated armed Uber drivers to ferry son Dante de Blasio to and from Yale University, where he was a student? I don't think that's in the, the job description of the detectives at all. Detectives President Michael Palladino commenting on reports that executive protection unit detectives drove Dante to and from New Haven. Sources with direct knowledge tell Telling CBS 2, the detectives made the trip seven or eight times during Dante's freshman year. The purpose of the detail is for safety and security. It's, it's not for uh, running errands or, or, or personal family business. Was there a specific and credible threat to Dante? If, if there was no specific credible threat against him, then it is a waste of taxpayers' money, dollars. Sources say the Department of Investigation is looking into the matter. A spokesperson telling CBS2, DOI is aware of the matter and declines further comment. As for comment, a de Blasio spokesman tweeted, the mayor didn't order protection, NYPD did. And an NYPD spokesperson said it does not discuss the security of elected officials. Betsy Gottbaum, executive director of the good government group Citizens Union, was critical of the mayor. I think it's a, a symbol, a little bit of sloppiness and a disregard for taxpayer money because I don't understand why a perfectly healthy kid needs a New York City police detail to take him back and to, to and from college. Well, Betsy Gottbaum says the mayor should reimburse the city for the gas and tolls, much as de Blasio's former correction commissioner, Joseph Pont, had to reimburse the city for using his city car for numerous trips to Maine. Dante has since graduated and is said to be thinking about a career in politics. All right, Marcia, thank you.